Fruit trees consist of three main parts. We have the canopy, we have the root system, which we can't see, and both of those are connected by the trunk. And so it's raining today. We're gonna to talk a little bit about the purpose of the canopy. The most obvious is that each one of these leaves is collecting sunlight and using the CO2 in the air and the water from the ground to create sugars. And the tree needs sugars to both ripen fruit, but it's also eating the sugars. It's feeding on the sugars and allowing the tree to do all of the natural processes that it needs to to survive. But another purpose of the canopy that's not really talked about too much is how the canopy is collecting the rain. And if you look at these leaves, they all point, come to a point, and they all face out away from the center of the tree. As droplets fall from one leaf to another, the tree is naturally pushing the water out to the very edge of the canopy. And so the very, if we could draw an imaginary line around the base of this tree where the edge of the canopy is, that is called the drip line. And it's called the drip line because the water is dripping from the leaves to the ground. And that area, the drip line of the tree is where we will find all of the, the real fibrous root system that, that collects the, the water that falls to the ground and pulls it into the rest of the tree. So if you look here, we've put this bark mulch around the base of the tree. And the purpose of this mulch is one, keep the weeds down, but two, it acts as a sponge and it, and it absorbs all of this water and it allows the water to remain even on a hot sunny day. But when you do put mulch around trees, you wanna bring the mulch clear out of the drip line because that's where the, the fibrous root system is and that's where the tree is gonna um, access the water the most. The third purpose of the mulch is it is slowly decomposing, it's breaking down and it's feeding this tree, but not too fast like synthetic fertilizers, but it's slowly breaking down and releasing small amounts of nitrogen and other minerals that the tree can use uh, to be healthy. The canopy not only collects sunlight to create sugars, but it's also pushing the water out to the drip line to make it more accessible for the rest of the tree.